Okay, in this part here, I got it, it's all thickness it, and after I just did the thickness, I just inserted some ports at the top here, as you see in this cylinder which is just made after I thickness it the port with the bar surfacing. So the problem came here if I just need to adjust the thickness. So how I just need how I'm gonna adjust the thickness without going back um, if I just rolling back to the thickness step it's gonna remove all the new features I just added at the top so I'm gonna show you a quick tip to increase the thickness and it's might be it might be a, sh a, a quick selection tip so I need to select all of this faces at the bottom to adjust the thickness for this board so I got two ways and they are just different from each other so the first step is I'm going to select this whole loop edge loop here and I'm going to unseal it so now I have these different or separated faces and I'm gonna delete this bottom so now it's all surface and easily I'm going to mesh tools press on a thickness so now I have ability to add a new thickness for this board so if I just say I just want to need to add minus three millimeters now I just adjusted the thickness and I'm gonna press OK so now this the problem just have been fixed and I just have new thickness now and everything seems great so the other way is so I just want to roll back until the old thickness here so as you see it's just center and I need to select all of this faces while it's just merged so let me just go back again okay now it's just one base the same way I'm gonna select this body so I'm just selecting this loop and what I'm gonna do is go to unseal again then selecting this face here so all of this body now is just free to move okay and I'm gonna get a boundary so press on the boundary and then select C so I'm just gonna apply it now it's all one body again now after that how I'm gonna quickly go and select I think I got some issues here. Let me just go back. Okay, again. Press on CU. One millimeter. Okay. Now. I'm going to the boundary tools. So we're going to see a face group that selected the faces I just wanted. So now I have ability to control these faces and change the thickness however I want. So let's say I just need it to be something like this. Okay. I'm going to hit convert and it should be applied and get a solid body. okay so as you see in here I have my board and my new added thickness without losing any details or having a bad surface okay so this is the method number one and I'm gonna show you the results after converting with the with the method number two and I'm gonna go back
Okay. I'm going to delete this face. Okay, now go to the thickness and minus 3. Okay, now I'm going to hit convert. And the same results. Now this is with the regular thickness solution and it's still perfect. So I hope you just enjoyed this video and learned something. See you next video.